Hello Bakers and welcome to Upside Down. All of us from time to time need to travel and when you're traveling you usually sometimes need to take your work with you. This is why today we are going to talk about mobile workstations. A few months ago I got my ZBook from HP and it's a great mobile workstation. Today I wanted to give you my overview about it and how I've been using it and as well how it's been performing. Now without further ado let's roll the intro. HP ZBook has been a great laptop and something which I really enjoyed using in the last few months. Some of the softwares and things that I've been using it for are 3D Studio Max, Photoshop as well I've been using it for Premiere and editing videos on the go and also I used it for scanning assets. It's been a great tool for using it scanning on the field and especially calculating some of the assets right while I'm still taking some of the photos. As you know this is something which I talked in some of my previous videos that scanning assets and being able to see the results right when you're still out there and taking more photos is very essential and something that can speed up and also save you lots of time in future. Now let's talk a little bit more about the power and as well about the specifications on this ZBook. I got the Intel Core i7, as well I have 32 gigs of RAM and for a video card I got RTX 2070 packed with 8 gigs of video memory. This configuration has been working great for me for using Unreal as well. I managed to completely create a project using just the mobile station and if you remember some of the Diablo videos that I did a while ago were created exactly using the ZBook. If you want to have a look on those I'm going to put a link down in the description below. I also recently worked on a VR project and half of the project I had to do while I was traveling so for me the HP ZBook worked great because I had to debake some of the textures using Substance Painter and as well I had to to assemble and do the final lights and as well some of the VFXs for the scene inside Unreal. There are a few things that you should have in mind about the workstation. One thing is that it can get a little bit noisy once you put some more heavy tasks, like for example exporting videos, especially if you are exporting some 4K videos, and as well if you are baking lights in Unreal. So have that in mind if you are using it for university or somewhere else, that it can get a little bit noisy. The second thing that I noticed, and it's also something which I think is a very minor thing, is that here where your wrists rest when you are typing on the keyboard, board get a little bit too warm especially if you have the laptop charging. I found that the laptop is a lot quieter and as well a lot cooler if you have it unplugged from the power supply. The good part is that the battery actually holds very nicely so even if you charge it fully and you want to go somewhere out and you forgot your charger you can still do quite a lot of work. You have few hours of working either in Unreal or for example if you're rendering something which is more than enough for calculating and doing some work on the go. Thank you for joining me in today's video I hope that it was useful and helpful for you. Like and subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss all the tutorials and content that I'm creating. See you next time!